absolutely beautiful. Goosebumps every single time. <laughs> All right, yo guys, what's going on? It's Soul Rage, and welcome back to some Halo 3. So apparently there are 1,328 gamers online, and a part of me has a slightly hard time believing that. I mean, if that number actually is accurate, then that's fucking awesome that there's 1,300 people still playing Halo 3 on Xbox 360. Granted, now I can't remember off the top of my head if Halo 3 is backwards compatible on Xbox One, but to uh, flex on everybody real quick, just to flex on everybody, look at this armor, look at this recon, man. Oh my. This is how you know you were a Halo 3 nerd, just putting in just a ridiculous amount of hours to get recon. Scout was pretty cool. This guy looks like Bumblebee and uh, Hayabusa, Hayabusa. I also really did like that armor set, but nah, recon is just like, that's just the big okay hand. That's how you know you're a fucking nerd. I just have so many memories on this game, and there's a reason as to why I'm playing on my original Xbox account, Rixquay. Again, like I was just saying, I have so many memories on this game, and Jesus Christ, all of my friends are offline. Like, this is really what Xbox 360 is like. See, now, I've talked about in the past how I have these three friends on Xbox Live that I've known literally since 2007 and still haven't removed them. This guy, Teambagger, right here, he was, I believe, my first friend on Xbox 360, and I met him playing Halo 3, and all he did was team kills. Dugger Beaver was somebody that I met while playing COD 4 and Spastic Chick Reg, and I still have her added on Facebook to this day. It's crazy to think about, like, that's really that stereotype of, like, you know, those friends that sign on, and then next thing you know, they're just offline forever. Halo 3 really was that game to me, and once again, we're back on it today because, as I'm sure most of you already all know this, but, uh, Halo Master Chief Collection is eventually going to be coming to PC, and I, again, thought it would just be a good idea just to come back, play a little bit of Halo 3 while talking about this, because, again, to me, there is just so many memories with Halo 3. I just, I used to put a relentless amount of hours into this game before COD 4 came out, and still, while COD 4 and World of War were in their life cycles, were in their main prime, I was still playing a ton of Halo just because I love this game so much. Definitely one of my favorite memories looking back playing Halo 3 was all the custom games, all like the custom Forge games that everybody made, like uh, Turkey Hunt, which basically was like Death Run. It was kind of like, uh, I mean, what else was it called? It was like Chicken Hunt, Chicken Snipe, some weird shit. Basically, though, it was like Death Run to where like the one uh, activator or sniper up top would have a sniper, a Spartan laser, and everybody else would just be running through the course trying to survive and get to the end. I had so much fun playing that. Uh, Griff Ball, Shoddy Snipers, all of that. Oh my god, man. I'm just so ready for all of this to come to PC and be able to play it in like 300 plus FPS. You know, the big PC flexes. Looks like two people didn't make it into the lobby, so it's about to be a five on three. And of course, they got like the Eagle and like a two-star general on their team. Oh my god, this feels so weird. Like the input delay from the sticks. This game is actually so beautiful. Yeah, oh my god. That face when you almost get splattered. Can I? Oh my Jesus Christ. This feels so weird to me. I haven't played this in so long. Oh my god. I can't believe I used to put so much time into this game and I thought that like this game was the greatest thing. I mean, this game is the greatest thing ever, but I'm gonna sound like such a PC elitist saying this, but like, was the controller inputs always this bad? It just feels so delayed when I'm moving from side to side and like the motion blur and oh Jesus. <laughs> There we go. Classic BR action. Let's get it. Where are these boys at? I don't know what you think you're doing. Fuck off, me boy. Aw, oh, shit. It's crazy for me to think about how, like, back in 2007 to 2008, while this game was surely in its prime, or basically just, like, really any old school game that we, like, come back, play all these years later, and we used to think that this game, like, looked so incredible. I mean, just look at this. You can see all of the jagged lines right there. This is nuts, man. I really just can't wait to see what this game looks like on PC. Uh, we also still don't have an exact release date for the Master Chief Collection on PC. I think at this point in time, it was announced uh, two or so weeks ago, and I don't know, again, exactly when it's going to be released. It might honestly be, like, later on this November or something. That's honestly when I would assume it. But if they if they nail the shit, if they really make it, like, a good PC port, honestly, I'd be really confident in saying that Master Chief Collection on PC would be one of the greatest games ever. Give me the Banshee. All right. Oh, Jesus Christ. I've been blown this in forever. Oh, let's go, boy. Oh, shit. Yep, he's shooting at me. Nah, I'm dead. <laughs> nice forehead, boy. Give me that. Nice forehead, get off me, boy! Then, of course, in Halo 3 Fash, gotta hit him with a teabag. Yeah, uh huh. Although, fun fact, I always used to hate using the battle rifle. I always preferred the assault rifle. Dude, get off me! Literally popping heads right now with a BR. This is incredible. Holy shit! Wait, so you're gonna tell me this man got hit by the Banshee out of midair and didn't get splattered? What? 
crazy at this video game. Game over. We actually lost that. It was a 3v5 and we lost. Ah, uh, yes. Team Slayer on high ground. I have a lot of good memories on this map too. So, you know, when it comes to Halo 3, like I've been talking about, I have a lot of good memories with this game, but also at the same time, I have a, a lot of bad memories. Like right up in that little sniper's nest area. I probably shouldn't have uh, been looking there, but see, Halo 3, fun fact, is actually the origin as to how I got my name Rage. Halo 3 was that game to me where the rage started, like really, really badly. Because the thing is, right up in that sniper's nest up there, or just, uh, well, especially on this map, I mean, like, that's where I would sit up in camp, but, uh, my thing with Halo 3 was that I always wanted to get perfectionists, right? And for those of you guys that don't remember, the way that you guys get perfectionists in Halo 3, or at least, I believe in all Halos, I could be wrong. At least in Halo 3, though, the thing that you needed to do was get a running riot, which is a 15 kill streak, and survive the entire game. And since my goal of basically every game was to get a perfectionist, oh, okay, he's got a mauler. Since my goal of every single game was to get a perfectionist, every time I died, I got extremely angry. Like, I used to throw controllers, and, um, I'm really ashamed to admit this, but I... Oh my god. But I legit ended up kicking a hole in a wall over this game. Well, it wasn't exactly a wall, because, like, where my setup used to be was, like, downstairs in the basement, and it was, like, on top of this fucking giant box thing. But I kicked a hole in that wall, because I died, like, one or two off a running riot, or I got killed off the running riot, and I just fucking Spartan kicked that shit. And again, I think I broke, like, two or three controllers over it just by throwing them across the room. Yeah, I, I was an angry little gamer, honestly. I was a very angry gamer, and, uh, still to this day, I get angry, but at Call of Duty instead. I can't stress this enough. It's been so long since I played this game, and man, honestly, I missed it so much. I'm also kind of an awful friend because my friend Noah, or Logic, has been wanting to play Halo 3 with me before he sold his Xbox, or before he sells it, so I need to let him know that I have it, uh, obviously, plugged in. Nice invisibility. Also, what I'm thinking, though, today is Wednesday. This video is more than likely gonna go up on Thursday, but honestly, I'm thinking of streaming this game for a little while now that I got my Xbox plugged up. So, for those of you guys that are interested in a Halo 3 stream, go ahead and let me know that down in the comment section below. I'm thinking more than likely, though, I'm gonna end up streaming this game on Friday, so be sure you guys are following me on Twitch as well. Shameless self-promotion. No, 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 you fucking don't. Come here, boy. Yeah, get out this shit. <gasps> No, no! <laughs> That's exactly what I used to do. I used to camp up there, get Spartan laser refills, and just try to get the running rides in perfection. This guy's got the turret. Get off me. He's got the rocket launcher. Get off me! You boys are doo-doo. <clears throat> I literally feel like I'm 11 years old playing this game again. This is fantastic. So again, though, as far as the whole Master Chief collection goes on PC, I think they're releasing Halo Reach first. I'm not exactly sure the order. I haven't really followed up on anything, but I heard rumors that, uh, again, Halo Reach was gonna release first in, like, two, three, four, and it was gonna go in order like that. I can't stress it enough, though. Like, I really hope that they absolutely nail it on PC, because if they do, oh my god, it's over. And a part of me is really hoping that it doesn't come out in November. I, I want it to come out sooner because I don't want to feel conflicted between Modern Warfare 4 and then the Master Chief Collection. I, I mean, I say Modern Warfare 4 or just really whenever the next Call of Duty. We still don't know. It's almost April and we still don't know. But honestly though, like if the next Call of Duty is to be Modern Warfare 4 and if Infinity War completely nails it, I just, I don't want to be torn between the two games because all I'm gonna want to do is feel like I'm 11 years old again and play Halo 3. What the English. fucking shit lobby did I just get into? Oh my god, I'm intimidated. Four people on their team are five star generals. I mean, I got one on my team and a three star. I'm just not ready to get my ship railed on this map though. Grenade! Good strap for the power drain. Boy, get off me. That boy's head is on fire. What? <sighs> this guy's actually nuts. He just sniped three of us and oh my god, I'm getting clipped. Wait a minute. Is he... Is this man cheating? There's almost no way unless this man is literally face fucking campy reincarnated. I don't believe it. I refuse to believe this shit. Uh, <laughs> Alright, there we go. Finally killed his ass. Come here, boy. Get the- get off me. I don't know who the fuck you think you're shooting at. Fine, here. Give me the sniper. I'm face camping. Oh, okay. No, I'm not. He's crazy. I just- I, I, I don't know what to say, honestly. I'm at a loss for words, especially if this guy is legit. just 360'd me! Oh my god! No, 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 no fucking way. No. Oh my- I, I can't even get mad at that, honestly. I mean, I'm gonna go back and look at this gameplay. Oh, he's just destroying- I- what? I'm actually having a hard time believing that this guy is legit, but at the same time, I mean, like, he's- he's just fucking crazy. What if he's, like, a legit five-star general who just has not stopped playing the game since September 25th, 2007? 
That's the only way this is possible because this is just ridiculous. He had 34 kills and three of my teammates left. I find that so hard to believe. Five star gen. Oh, wait a minute. I just looked at his uh, social match. Yeah, something doesn't seem right. He's, uh, something doesn't seem right here. I need to have a look at this because I don't believe what just happened to me. All right, where is this dude? Uh, who was it again? Yeah, Jurassic Park, the guy with the flaming head. H how do I get it to first person mode? Hello? Unless I'm stupid, I, I don't know how to get it to first person. I, I don't know, honestly. I really wish I could see this first person because I just, I don't believe this is legit. This is ridiculous. Wait a goddamn second. Look at this. Yeah, hell no, that's not legit. What the fuck, brother? Unless there's something I'm missing here, like, I, I don't know how to get it to just play first person. Like, I don't know. I mean, like, I get that he knows spawns and everything. I mean, like, uh, the spawns on Narrows are pretty straightforward. Everyone just spawns by the ramps, but it's just the most ridiculous flicks I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, and he's just popping everybody right there while strafing in the air. And then he fucks my day up? Yeah, hell nah, brother. I'm just trying to find that clip where he just 360s the living shit out of me. I knew it was towards the end of the game. Running, he picked up the sniper rifle. He just knows I'm there. Yeah, just destroys my day. Looking around at the spawn. He doesn't see us yet. Jumps up, turns around. Yeah, right here. Destroys me. Completely destroys me. He doesn't see us there. Then it locks on to us. Yeah, the, yeah, that smooth transition. Bullshit. Okay, all right. Out of the near 12 years, that Halo 3 has been a thing. I don't think I've ever seen anything like that before. I guess to an extent, I really shouldn't be all that surprised by it. Just, you know, considering the fact that this game is that old, hasn't been updated in forever. But dude, it's Halo 3. Come on, man. What are you doing? This game is honestly so much fun. And I know I'm probably looking at this through rose tinted glasses, but Halo 3 really was just that game on Xbox 360. I really do have a whole lot of high hopes for Master Chief Collection though. Like if they can seriously nail it on PC, I feel like it's going to be incredible. So anyways, though guys, once again, I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this Halo 3 video. I really hope you guys have enjoyed. If in the near future you guys want me to make some more Halo 3 videos here on Xbox 360, go ahead and let me know that down in the comment section below, as well as go ahead and leave your thoughts and opinions on Halo Master Chief Collection coming to PC. Once again, I hope you guys enjoyed this Halo 3 video. Leave a like if you guys do. Subscribe if you're new. It's been Soul Rage. I will talk to you guys later. Take care, everybody.